What's up guys, my name is Brock. You're watching The Modest Man and today I'm gonna to show you my everyday carry. Okay, if you're not familiar with the concept of everyday carry or EDC, it's pretty simple. Uh, your everyday carry is just the stuff that you bring with you when you leave the house. You know, so if you're going to school or work or on a date or out with friends or wherever, uh, you know, us guys, we bring a set of items, of objects with us in our pockets uh, wherever we go. Now, most men are very particular, they're very intentional about what they carry because unlike women who have purses, you know, we only have our pockets. So we have limited space and so we have to be uh, intentional about, you know, what we put in our pockets. Now, EDC is also kind of a hobby. Lots of guys are into collecting everyday carry items, uh, often called pocket jewelry. Uh, you know, everything from accessories to uh, key organizers to multi-tools and knives and other weapons. And it's not that they carry all this stuff with them every time they leave the house. It's just more of a, you know, a collector's thing. It's more of a hobby. Now, as an aspiring minimalist, I try to limit myself to the bare necessities. Uh, uh, when it comes to the things I'm gonna carry around in my pockets when I leave the house. So that's what I'm gonna show you today, just the stuff that I pretty much always bring with me no matter where I'm going. Okay, so first up we have my phone. This is the iPhone 7. Uh, I usually try to upgrade to the latest model and um, you know I don't keep a case on it. I, I think these phones are so beautifully designed and a case sort of ruins the, the form and the aesthetic. Um, I've never actually dropped a phone and broken it or cracked a screen, so you know, knock on wood. Um, and I usually opt for the smaller model because honestly, I think smartphones have gotten a little too big and since I have somewhat small hands, I can barely reach the top of the screen as is. So I usually opt for the smaller version of whatever the latest iPhone is. And I keep this in my front right pocket. Okay, second we have my wallet. This one is from Anson Calder. I believe it's called the uh, eighth inch calfskin wallet. Uh, this is a beautiful wallet. Um, I love minimal wallets and this is by far the most minimal one I've ever found. Uh, it's got a tiny footprint and it's enough for a little bit of cash. I usually carry two bills, two 20s right here in the front. Um, I got my business credit card, personal debit, driver's license, and then I'll usually keep a Metro card right here in the middle. So this is an awesome little wallet if you don't like to carry a whole lot of stuff. Um, and I've tried a lot of minimalist wallets. I haven't found one as minimal as this. So uh, definitely a huge fan. Okay, of course I have to carry my keys around. Um, you know, I've tried to find like various key organizers. I know there's a bunch of different solutions, everything from sliders to uh, like leather slips and stuff, but this is the most minimal uh, solution I can come up with. You know, it's just my, my office key, my house key, my car key, and it's just on a very small key ring. And I find that this is very little bulk, so I keep this in either my front left pocket or my back right pocket if I'm not sitting down, and uh, it pretty much disappears. You know, every now and then it'll get a little pokey, so I don't know, if you have like a good solution for a, a pocket key organizer, uh, I'd love to hear about it, so let me know down in the comments. Okay, I pretty much always have my sunglasses with me. These are the Warby Parker Beckett's. These are the old models, so I think they have a slightly different version of these now. Um, you know, I always used to buy cheap sunglasses, but uh, I, I really, really love these Warby Parkers. These are prescription. Uh, and you know, basically, unless it's nighttime or like a super cloudy day, I'm wearing sunglasses. Uh, and since I wear them so much, if I go outside without these things, it's just like blinding. So now if I'm gonna be out for a while, like if I'm gonna transition from day to night, I will also bring uh, a pair of regular glasses, especially if I'm going to be driving at night. So I'll usually just bring uh, one of these cases and I'll just swap them out my sunglasses in the case and wear my regular glasses. So that's only if I'm gonna be transitioning though. Normally I just either bring my regular glasses or my sunglasses with me, uh, you know, in my pockets or wearing them. Okay, the fifth thing I pretty much always have is a watch. Uh, this is the Hamilton uh, Khaki Mechanical. It's often called the Officer Mechanical. It's a hand wind watch. And I'll do a full review of this watch, but it is a great everyday watch, uh, pretty casual. Uh, really goes with my style. And so I'm pretty much always wearing a watch. So of course I'm not carrying it in my pocket, but it's still kind of part of my everyday carry. Okay, another thing I always carry is uh, a small tin of breath mints. So these are the Altoids Smalls, uh, the wintergreen flavor. And I love these because uh, of course I like having fresh breath. I don't really like chewing gum and the big tins of Altoids are just too big to carry around. So these are perfect. And if I don't have these in my pocket, I usually have them in my desk drawer, my briefcase, uh, my gym bag. So I, I just have a few of these 
little uh, tins, you know, around pretty much always accessible. Uh, and I really, really like them. So you can usually find these for like around a dollar a piece, even cheaper if you buy them in bulk. It's also great to be able to offer your neighbor a breath mint. So for example, if you're taking off on a plane or uh, you know you just finished dinner with a group, it's always nice to be the guy that has uh, a little thing of breath mint. No one ever says no to a mini Altoid. They're refreshing and delicious. Okay, and the last thing I carry is just a small folded up tissue. Um, I find that it's just nice to have uh, a tissue. Uh, when you need one, you really need one. So I just usually carry a folded tissue in my back pocket. Uh, and it's also great when someone else needs a tissue. Like if someone sneezes and they don't have a tissue, it's just awkward. So to be able to offer a clean tissue to somebody is very nice. I know some people carry handkerchiefs, but let's be honest. Do you really want to use a handkerchief and put it back in your pocket? I think a tissue is better. Um, if you use it, you can just throw it away. And then next time you come across a tissue box, uh, you can you know, just grab a fresh one, fold it up, put it back in your pocket. And that's it, that's my standard everyday carry. You know, of course it varies slightly. I'll change my, my sunglasses or my glasses. I'll swap out my watch. But uh, you know, this is pretty much what I carry every day when I leave the house. I'd love to hear from you. You know, what do you keep in your pockets when you leave the house? Uh, is it pretty much the standard stuff like this? Or do you have anything else, anything interesting? Uh, let me know down in the comments. And until next time, stay stylish.